Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and another question from a user. That is an interesting question too. And it's the fact that I'm doing nothing, but it seems like there's still some communication going on on the network uh, with my Wi-Fi or, or the Ethernet connection. And of course, the uh, viewer has seen this while looking at the task manager. Now you see here, I've got nothing running except the task manager, and yet got little spikes of data going on. Uh, and uh, checking out what's happening with this is how come if there's no app open with an internet access that I get these spikes in communications on the Wi-Fi. So first, some of these spikes are simply a protocol communication, meaning your network card is checking with the router or your modem to see if the connection's still working. So they're doing a little hand sh a handshake, basically, to say, hi, I'm here, you're there, yeah, cool, speed is good. So if you look at what's received or sent, it's very small data. So you'll have, you know, um, 40 kilobytes per second, 30 kilobytes per second, very, very low speeds. So these are mostly handshakes that are happening with the device and the uh, router you're using on a modem. Now, there are other things also that can spike here, and sometimes it could be an app. There's a lot of apps running in the background. If you're wondering how come my weather is here, well, my weather is here, and the reason it's here, and it's updating from time to time. So that update to bring me what the weather is uh, actually will sometimes create a spike because there'll be a check to the weather server. Uh, Windows itself could be doing a check. It could be Windows Update suddenly activating itself and looking at the servers of Microsoft saying, hey, is any updates? So there's tons of little things that can happen in the background. If you want to know what, if you want to try to see could there be malicious uh, things, most of the time it'll pop up in the processes section. If you look on the processes and you put a check little when you click, you have this little arrow, up and down arrow. You put it pointing down, which means that anything that's using the internet will have a uh, number to it. Once again, you see that it's very low numbers. It was Microsoft Edge in this case. So there's something in a Microsoft Edge process that is you know, going and checking something on the internet quickly. Once again, a lot of the processes and a lot of the features, including the weather from the uh, widgets here, often come down to the fact that it's Edge controlling everything in the background for the uh, access. So here you'll have what's using your up-down connection. Um, if there's a malicious you know, software, something not right, uh, well, at least here you'll know by looking at the network speeds what is the process that is using internet connectivity. And then you can either Google it, search for what exactly is this, or you know, uh, if, if you downloaded something and you're not sure, could it be malware? Well, if it doesn't give access to the internet for downloading packages and stuff, uh, it's probably gonna show up here somewhere. Sometimes it could be invisible. Some. Uh, a lot of malware actually use this trick, which is they show up here, but they uh, make the letters the same color as a background. So everything that you, when you look here, you see an empty slot. Seems there's nothing, yet it's using some, you know, network speed or or any other things. Uh, that is often often a, 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 a is something that to examine. Uh, because when something is invisible, it often isn't a good thing on a uh, on in the task manager processes. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and uh, once again, uh, nothing to worry for the most part uh, for these little spikes here and there. It's totally normal.